Using our Hope Art mixers, we mix up big batches of foam latex so that we can spatulate it on top of our bodysuits. Then we inject them into our molds and pull out our masks, which we then seam and patch and paint. All our costumes are made in America. We don't send anything out to China. We do it all here, top craftsmen, and we hand paint and detail everything. So we're making full body foam latex zombie suits. When we make them for our haunted attraction line or for our film projects, we take a spandex suit on a body form, and then we have these sculpted bone pieces that we created, and we attach them with foam latex, spatulate foam latex all over the whole thing, texture it, then we put it in the oven and bake it out for a day, and we spray a surface coat of latex over the top to seal it. Then we go in and hand paint everything with our latex paints. So this is our new big oven. We just built it. We had to do it in a week. And we have a circulating uh, heating duct, and the furnace is on the back, and the thing heats up to about 150 degrees in about 10 minutes. Very efficient. It's uh, got plenty of space for us to put all our full bodies and all our masks when we run them. Working on a flesh mask for the art show that we have going on um, at the Mansfield Art Center this weekend. Uh, last minute, throw some stuff together. I've been dreading this day. We have an art gallery show, Mansfield Art Center, and they're basically taking my whole shop over there to set up for this thing. Starts on Saturday. For me, I can't even go in there. I'm gonna freak out if anything gets broken. Now they're they're taking the clubhouse away. Guarantee it. Broke. I'm gonna freak out. What the? Why are you such a prick today? Why in a fancy mood? Because they're loading all the shit out of here today. It's gonna get messed up. It always does. They're getting fucking broke and they're gonna yeah. fit. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, I know that. I know the Wishmaster statue is going down, dude. And it's not even packed as well. Put the silencer on that drill. So the saw blades were kind of drug a little bit. A couple of teeth broke off on the that big saw blade we used for the mushroom head video. I can't tell him that shit. That's bullshit. What the fuck are you doing? I love pushing his buttons. And I wonder why my hair gets all fucking gray. Look at this shit. Didn't have one when I started here. <laughs> there he goes on another fucking ramp, dude. Dude, sick, ain't he? I'm telling you, he, he, he used to see how anal he was when he was younger. He used to put all his monster magazines in little tiny baggies, <laughs> stack them up, put them, categorize them with number counts and everything. It's sick. He's got issues. I know this in the middle of the floor. Watch him. Watch when he comes back in. You guys need to pick up after yourself. Stop filming me. Dude, how'd it go? Fine. Nothing's broken. No, no, nothing's broke. You guys just like messing <laughs> I with I was just man. fucking with you about the saw blades and shit. No, it's fine. Yeah, well, <laughs> I'm used to shit getting broken. No, oh, man, everything's fine. Yeah, well. When have I ever broken anything moving stuff? When have I ever done that? <laughs> the mill? Other than that. Yeah, whatever. Everything's fine, dude. It went over. Relax. Everything's good. Great. Fuck me. All right, all you up-and-coming makeup artists out there, when you're working on a movie and you have a tight schedule, you got to learn how to multitask. So today, I'm making four molds at once, and they're all appliance layups. I've already done the flashing and laid them out on the board. Now I'm going to do four splash coats, four hemp batches, and then four finish coats, and knock these out all at the same time. So if you want to work in the film industry on a tight schedule, you got to multitask. you got to learn how to do this.
me, but I'm at work right now. No, I don't need an air purifier and don't call. Is that what you're calling for? What? What just? Yes, no, no sales calls. Thank you very much. Why? What the fuck? Because every time I try to do something, like if I'm doing, if I'm doing movie crap or other stuff, I'm doing those boobs the other day. I mean, like firecracker stuff. No, then no. When I'm trying to do my stuff, well, let's see scenes, crap. Well, now you're just fucking me all the time. I can't concentrate. I can't get nothing done. So I'm working on this one now. Doing this one together. And the Terror Twins, I call. And then this one over here is a, this is a, it's a baby trap. Or it's the, uh, what do you call it, the trapeze artist with no arms? That, that, that way. <laughs> God damn it, you don't fucking. Ah! I'm trying to get something fucking done. Come on, whatever, oh, dude. He was just kidding. Where's he going? I don't know. Goddamn keys! Get the fucking thing out of here! Just get my fucking keys! Come on, dude. No, it's not fucking here. I'm just kicking the goddamn door. Door's locked. I know. Come on. Push the buzzer. There we go. I, I no. Keys. Dude, what's the issue? This, I try to get this done. I keep lighting shit up all the fucking time. I'm not fucking funny. I'm never getting nothing done. Come on, dude. He was just kidding. Yeah, he was. Yeah, but every, every fucking time I try to do something, <laughs> wait till we're working on something. It's, the movie crap, which well, not my personal stuff, and see if you do it then. Oh no. And you want dummy for you fucking. Bye. This is what it's like every day. 20 different artists, 20 different temperaments. You never know what's gonna happen. <laughs>